Governor Ron DeSantis and Republican leadership are up against a trio of new proposed amendments that would make it easier to vote. Yeah, Stuart, the move comes just weeks after the governor signed into law a measure that will make it harder for people to vote. The Western News political reporter Greg Fox explains the new measures that could be on the ballot next year. So right now I have what we think is the, the strongest election integrity measures in the country. I'm actually going to those opposed to the governor and Republican leadership disagree. Just as the new law limits the availability of mail ballot drop boxes and requires voters to request mail ballots every election cycle, progressive groups want to add more voting freedom in the state constitution. I don't know what the demographic partisan makeup of this group is. I just know that I want more people eligible to vote. Former Democratic state lawmaker Sean Shaw is supporting three proposed constitutional amendments that would make voter registration automatic when you do business with the Department of Motor Vehicles. Another would legalize voter registration during early voting and on Election Day. And the last would make former felons automatically eligible to vote regardless of whether they have paid their financial obligations. Tackling these one at a time, the motor vehicle law would be automatic, not optional. That means if you, for example, renew or obtain a new license, you would be automatically registered to vote. One of the proposed amendments, and it would be the same as it is in nearly two dozen other states, would allow a person either during early voting or on election day to come to a precinct or right here to election headquarters and to register to vote. The last proposed amendment is nicknamed the Amendment 4 Fix. You still would have to pay your financial obligations, court fees, and restitution to victims. But that would no longer preclude you from voting while you are working to pay off that debt. People cheat. They really do. The head of Orange County's Republican Party tells me allowing people to register at the polls is an invitation to rampant voter fraud, even though it's the law in 21 other states. And there is absolutely no way for the Democrats or the Republicans to make sure that the system maintains its integrity. Orange County Election Supervisor Bill Cowles is not a fan of registering at the polls because verification in time to meet election reporting deadlines would be extremely difficult. Well, I think as a general opinion of most supervisors is that those type of things don't belong in the Constitution. Cowles is in favor of making voter registration automatic to encourage more people to vote. In Orange County, Greg Fox, Washington News.